My area of research is Italy from the 14th to the first part of the 16th century. It's a period that's usually known as the late Middle Ages or the Renaissance. And my own area of interest is the cultural and intellectual movement that gives the name to the Renaissance. So the revival of antiquity, of ancient Greece and Rome. The people in this time were not just really interested in antiquity, not really just invested in studying about it. They wanted to use what they learned to shape their own world, the ideas and the ideals, the uh, art and literature. They wanted to use those things to shape their politics, their ethics, their society, their intellectual world, and the way that they wrote about their own past. This is what I'm really interested in. And it matters to me for all sorts of reasons. Some of them are personal, some of them are professional. I think one of the things that the revival of classical antiquity can teach us is just why history is so important. The people of this time studied antiquity very creatively, uh, and they applied what they learned and adapted it to a really different world, their own very different contemporary world. And they realized history mattered, that studying the past could be really useful. And so by learning about how they did that and why they did that, I think we can learn a lot about why history should matter to us, why we should study it, and how we can engage really creatively with our own past to make it useful for us.